Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a little bit different than normal. I'm actually going to be doing a master bedroom tour. So a bit of backstory, my parents are property developers or were, they're now retired. Um, and interior design has always been something that I absolutely love. And as you can probably tell throughout the, as you get to see more and more rooms, you'll see that grey is a favourite colour. Um, I bought my first house when I was 20, 20 or 21? 20 or 21, um, had to fully renovate that. I'm very lucky because my dad is very, very handy. Um, that was fully renovated and that was properly 50 shades of gray <laughs> in a interior design sense. Um, and then that got rented out and then I bought this place, which I bought just over a year ago and now live in with my boyfriend. And we are three quarters, quarters? Quarters of the way through um, finishing off the the interior the interior design the development the renovation so this is the first room that i wanted to show you i will do a sort of series on on this as as and when things are complete so i know this room um is nearly done so i'm going to show it to you the next one will probably be the spare bedroom which i am i've been out and bought things over the past few months i guess um had things delivered and we're now in lockdown so i thought let's use this time to finish it off uh, but that's another video and then the last things I've got to get done are the kitchen, the downstairs bathroom and the kitchen and bathroom flooring downstairs as we've had new carpet throughout apart from those areas. So that's the, the backstory. Let me know if you enjoy this video and I'll show you around the rest of the flat as when it's completed. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoy. So as you come up from the bedroom, you then see the main part of the bedroom, clearly the bed. <laughs> um, we have a super king size bed and it is the best thing I have ever bought and I would never go back to a king size. Um, so yeah, obviously the main part of the bedroom is where you sleep. So my the left hand side is my boyfriend Rob's and the right hand side is mine. I am a bit of a hoarder for cushions and pillows. So there are two box pillows at the back, um, six normal pillows so you've got two grey two blue and two white and then you have two blue and gold and one gold cushion at the front you then have a grey throw and a blue blanket so it all ties in as you can probably tell the theme of the room is blue gold and grey um the frame i was given for christmas just gone from my mum and dad and i absolutely love it i then have obviously matching bedside tables matching lamps and then matching mirrors behind i just really like the look of the mirrors it makes the room look a little bit bigger I just really like it so i will show you the boyfriend side so he has got obviously a radiator on his side um we then got he's got rubbish in his drawers i'm not even going to go into them we have a little chair matching the cushions of the room obviously um and then ignore the clothing rail that is because i just did a haul before so just ignore that and then I have a cute little frame on the wall with some photos of family and friends and then on my side exactly the same i always have a drink on the, um, the side of the table as you can see and then as the pink thing is a hot water bottle, I have a pelvic um, pain issue, so I always have hot water bottles with me. I must have seven or eight in the house dotted about. On my bedside table, I always have, like I said, a drink and then a book and then my glasses. In my drawers, I have the bottom drawer normally has like diaries, journals, pen, paper, notebooks, any extra charges, all that sort of stuff. And the top mainly has beauty things like lip balms, medication, um, I have quite a bit of medication, so that's in the drawers, um, dental floss, all that sort of stuff that you just want to grab, earplugs because my boyfriend snores like a bloody trooper, so anything that's easy to grab is in there. We then have probably one of my favourite things in the room, 
which is this gold alcohol trolley that my sister got me for Christmas, just gone as well. Obviously, everyone seems to buy me interior stuff because it's something that I love. Um, and this has a, it's not a designer bag, it's just a plain black side shoulder bag, um, which just matches the trolley and I love it there. We then have a vase with some fake flowers, but it just looks really pretty, I think, so I keep it there. We then have some of my perfumes. I'll show you the others later. Um, these are the ones I use the most. So we've got Giorgio Armani C, two bottles of that. They've both run out, which is really upsetting, or running out. And then my current one is this pink one on the right hand side, which is Olympia Legend, and it smells like chocolate, and it is absolutely amazing. So I de definitely recommend that one. I then have some books, which are, you know, chosen because they're all white and gold. Um, I'm a little bit sad, can you tell? So yeah, that is my little trolley and I love it there. And then we have my little white mannequin, which I've had for years and I just love it. So that stays there. And then I am in the mirror. Over here is what I call the dumping area. Um, this is the main storage unit in the room. It has everything from DIY to electricals um, to envelopes. All the rubbish that I can't fit anywhere else comes up here. This is more storage. It does have everything that I need. So I've got in the little hessian box over here that is all my jewelry i'm gonna have all my nail varnishes down there uh, more books down there and my big dslr camera um some hair bits in the box at the end so yeah this is just the dumping area we then have behind the door um our dressing gowns and we have the vacuum cleaner for some reason is up here and then our washing basket so that is that area but if you come over here this is what I like to call our garden. So we live in a duplex apartment. So we live on two floors. We live on the second floor and the third floor. Um, and obviously our bedroom's up on the third floor and this is the view. So that's the other block from ours. Uh, we do have quite a lot of bit of green space outside, but like I said, nothing private. We are actually wanting to open this up into like a rooftop terrace. Um, so hopefully we get permission to do that. And it's very green and pretty and I just love it here. It just makes us feel like we have more space and there's lots more air than if we just had a window. So I love that. So from the window, this is the bedroom. You then go into the dressing room. So this is also my favorite. I just love this room. This is obviously like the piece de resistance or however you said, I'm not French, um, of the flat. The room is really big and it's just my favorite room I've ever, ever had. Um, I got a really over the top chandelier, which is actually like a silver glitter chandelier. It's very over the top, but I do love it. You then have my little chair, which matches the room. So obviously the gold, the blue and the gray again, and then a mirror, my ring light um, and the box. This is obviously the dressing room, but also doubles up as the filming area with the bedroom in the back. If you're used to watching my videos and this chair is obviously like where I do all my makeup, I drag it over to this box, and that's kind of my area that I do things. In this box, there is a lot of hair stuff. So I must have probably 10 different types of curling irons, um, straighteners, hair dryers, rollers, all that. And then my day-to-day -day makeup bag sits in there as well. So that is kind of like my go-to box, just keeps everything neat and tidy and out the way, and it can all look a mess in there, but at least it keeps it out of the way. So in here, the left hand side is my side, the right hand side is my boyfriend's side. So we'll ignore his side because boys are messy and as long as he shuts the doors, I don't care. Um, but this is my side. So in the left hand wardrobe we have, I'll show you, it is a mess so I apologise. Um, in the left hand wardrobe we have all of my dresses and skirts. On the back of the door we have like hoodies and cardigans. We have trainers up there, dresses, skirts or trousers down here and then shoes that is like i can't remember that's my high heel box so that's all of that stuff and as you can see it's like a florist in there and if you open the right hand side this is all my cardigans and tops so you might recognize some things from my recent hauls um that's all my tops and then down there's all my casual shoes and like sandals a couple of pairs of heels up there and then jeans i apologize about the mess i can't fold clothes very well and then all of my hoodies here so if I close it, I'm not going to show you that one. It's just got my underwear in, vest tops, all that sort of stuff. And it's a mess. So we'll ignore that. And then here is our dressing table unit. One tip for you. If you are wanting to buy a um, like 
island sort of thing they can be ridiculously expensive like i was looking at them for eight nine hundred pounds until i thought let's get two sideboards and put them back to back so the runner obviously hides the seam in the middle um they are pulled apart a little bit at the minute but i will push them back together in a moment obviously one side for my boyfriend one side for me we have the runner on and then some more fake flowers but i just love them it just makes the pulls the room together so i really love that in here is a mix of things so the left hand side is all my sewing items so anything that i want to be sewn adjusted altered all that sort of stuff it also has um, an empty makeup box i used to use and i did makeup on clients and it also has my belts for clothing this side has a box yeah so that is my at the bottom is my gel nail kit so it's got the uv lamp and all that sort of stuff and that's just got everything that is a, such a mess but that's where everything goes to die basically so yeah and then these are my makeup drawers so i apologize about the mess again this is my foundations and powders contours um concealers all that sort of stuff so everything for your base and for your the full face sort of stuff goes in here um we then have eyes so eyelashes um mascaras all that sort of stuff like kind of you know little pots of glitters and all that sort of stuff and we then have the um brushes which will need cleaning so i apologize for that and any um what's the one? sponges <laughs> but that's like eyes and applications i also apologize about my fingernails at the minute they've all snapped off so we'll just wait for them to grow and then my final box has all my lip lip stuff so lip liners liquid lipsticks lip glosses mattes shimmers all that sort of stuff it then also has um all my palettes down there so they range from drugstore to i've also got morphe palette anastasia river hills all that sort of stuff or anastasia sorry um and then all of like my makeup equipment so wipes um spoolies all that sort of stuff so yeah that is my beauty unit on the top we have just two candles i think they're battery operated ones because i don't want to start a fire um a frame of me and my boyfriend and then a little truck i got him don't ask it's just like an inside joke and the kettle once again i have hot water bottles all the time so there's a kettle in the bedroom and there's a kettle obviously in the kitchen so just ignore that but yeah that is the bedroom um as i said it's my favorite room in the house we have obviously a tv over there our fireplace and then that normally has a playstation on it but my boyfriend has been kicked out and sent downstairs so he's taking his playstation with him we obviously have an alexa there as well we have one upstairs and one downstairs which is great when i want to announce something when my boyfriend's up here so yeah that is the bedroom really so that is the bedroom tour as you can see behind me um i know it's a little bit different but i thought i'd just show you what goes well not what goes on but what is on or in behind the scenes when i'm filming um it is my pride and joy i love this room and i just thought i'd give you i'd show you so i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you like my room um let me know if you have any questions and i'd love to see pictures of your rooms um so yeah hope you have a lovely week and stay safe